One of my most asked questions is when are the PR boxings coming back? When are you going to do a PR haul? The answer is today. Today we are doing a PR unboxing. Hello, if it's your first time here, welcome. My name is Molly. I love doing all things beauty on this channel. I love doing tutorials as well as makeup reviews. Sometimes I do unboxings like today. So I have, I was doing a series on my channel of PR hauls and I did them weekly and I know a lot of you guys really, really enjoyed them. But to be honest with you guys, they are pretty time consuming to film because I do have to sit there and unbox every single thing. I have to swatch every single, every single thing. Um, um, they are just time consuming to film. I do have two little babes now. I had my daughter back in July, so she is now eight months old. And I will be honest with you guys, it's just something that I decided to take a step back from just because they are so time consuming. And also when it comes to these PR unboxings, I was waiting to open the boxes until I was on camera with you guys. So as you can imagine, that would be quite overwhelming when I'm unboxing like 15 boxes at a time. Um, it wasn't really giving me a chance to like try out the makeup as it came in and kind of slowly work it into my collection. It was kind of giving it to me all at once and it was getting a little bit hard to manage everything and to really try everything out and to be excited about each launch because I feel like I was opening it all at once. That being said, I know a lot of you guys really enjoy these and you miss them. So I actually got a lot of boxes yesterday and I got a ton today. So I have quite a few boxes that I um, didn't have time to open or anything yesterday. So I thought I'd unbox them with you guys and there's a few that I've already kind of peeked in but I haven't like swatched or anything like that. So I thought we'd sit down and do this. My kids are napping and I was like, we'll film one because I know you guys that miss them. So I'm going to start. I know that was like a long introduction, but I do want to kind of give an update on like why I kind of took a step back from doing them as much. Another reason too is because I am pretty limited to how often I can film and I kind of just wanted to be able to do like more product reviews for you guys and stuff. And I do feel like these videos were kind of limited me with doing them once a week. So there's that. But first box here is from the brand Sade. Sade, I think is how you say that. So they have some really nice stuff. I tried out their um, tint, like their tinted moisturizer. I think it's really great. So they sent over two packages here. So I have two different products from them. The first one is the R Set Radiant Loose Setting Powder. I have mine in the shade Translucent. Um, something I wanted to note too that's really nice is they actually use cotton balls as their like package stuffing. So this is what's like saving your products from getting damaged. And it's literally just like this thing of cotton rounds and you can like open it up and use them it says. So that's really cool. I think that's awesome that they're doing that so that you don't have any like necessary waste. Like all it is is just this bag and that can be recycled and then you can just use the cotton rounds. I think that's amazing that they're doing that. I've never seen a brand use that before, so I thought that was cool. So here's what the powder looks like. I'm excited to try that out. And then this I am really excited about is they sent over their new Dew Blushes. These are the Liquid Cheek Blushes. So they sent over two different colors for me. I have Spicy and then also Chili. I've really been getting into like cream and liquid products, so when they said they wanted to send this my way, I was like, yes, please. So it does have like a little Dofa applicator. kind of looks like a lip products, but this is for your cheeks. So I'm definitely going to give this a try. Very excited to um, get more from the brand because I haven't tried a ton from them. So I'm excited to give these products a go again. Um, like always, I'll try to link as much as I can down below for you guys to check out if you want to shop any of these brands. And then we have NARS up next. They sent over this little packaging right here that was like a little zip up. You can see my cat. She might make an entrance here. She likes to hang out down in my beauty room. So they sent over the summer collection. So this is the summer unrated collection. So I think they sent over two different cheek products and then also a eyeshadow palette. So let's see what the eyeshadow palette looks like. I really haven't seen much about this collection. I think there was a few more pieces to it. Ooh, pretty. They have the best packaging. Look at that. So, so sleek. And then the inside. All right. It's like a neutral pink palette. Very pretty. NARS has some really good eyeshadows. I will say like back in the day, I feel like they weren't my favorite eyeshadow formula just because I feel like they were a little bit like maybe lackluster. They're just, it's not that they're lackluster. They just have a different um, style of eyeshadow. It's like not your super like pigmented, crazy pigmented type of shade. And I think back when I was like first trying their stuff, I was like, I don't know how I feel about this. It's not as pigmented as like I'm used to. But I feel like now with my makeup preferences changing a little bit, I kind of like a little more subdued eye look. So I'm definitely more into their stuff than I feel like I used to be. But here are the cheeks. Again, really cool packaging. So I think there's two of these. So I have a blush in the inside and then also a bronzer. And then they sent over this other one. So inside of here you have the Orgasm and Laguna. So very cool little duos here from them. And then also 
that eyeshadow palette, and this is a really nice little travel case from them. How cute is this little set that Glossy Pop sent over? If you guys haven't tried them before, they are just like the cutest little lip glosses. So what they have is a lip balm on top, and then when you open it up, you like twist it, it's a lip gloss on the bottom, and they're shaped like a little lollipop, hence the Glossy Pops, and they all have like little charms on the bottom. They are so cute. They're bedazzled. These would make a perfect like little um, gifts for your kids like in their Easter baskets. Would be so, so cool. So yeah, these are fun. This is like a little Easter set, so it came with three different ones. So this one has an egg on it, and then this one has like a little flower. I just think they're adorable. So like I said, perfect gifts, and I think they look so cute. In my beauty room, I've kind of like started collecting them because they're so pretty, so pretty. So thank you, Glossy Pops, for sending that my way. I did not know they were coming out with this. Ooh, I'm excited. We got a new product from Yensa. This is a new foundation. Okay, this is the Super Serum Silk Foundation. It offers a skin-like, full coverage glow while working to help firm, smooth, and brighten your complexion. All right, if you guys don't know or you haven't heard of Yensa, they are a really, really great brand. They have a lot of skincare products, and they also have, I believe it's called their BC Foundation, and that one's really, really nice. So this is a new one from them, Super Serum Silk Foundation. It has vitamin C and E, um, eight super black ingredients. That's kind of like their theme, that all of their products have the eight ingredients. So, ooh, cute packaging. Here's what that looks like. So it looks like they sent me three different shades. So I have, this one was... Um, light medium and then I have light neutral and also light warm. I am also an affiliate with Yensa and they have a very high percentage for my uh, coupon code. So it's actually 30% off their website, which is pretty high for an affiliate. Um, so if you want to purchase anything from Yensa, you want to try out this foundation, get 30% off. You can use my code Makeup Molly. I am definitely going to be giving this a try. Let me know if you guys want to see like a review on this or something because I would definitely be doing that. If not, I'll do like a demo over on my Instagram. And then their sister brand is Pure Lease, which I'm sure you guys have heard of Pure Lease. If you have not, they are a skincare brand and they are the sister brand to Yensa. So my coupon code works with both brands. And again, it's 30% off for Pure Lease as well. So they actually reached out to me and asked if I wanted any like restocks on any products. They know I love them so much. And I was talking to my contact there and I said, you know, I really miss your makeup wipes. I wish you guys still had them because they had the best best makeup wipes. They discontinued them, or at least they're not on their website anymore, but she said they had a few around the office, and she's like, let me send you some still, and so I'm so excited because I'm not someone who uses makeup wipes a ton, but when I do, I tell you guys, these are the best makeup wipes, they're the ones that I want, so I that was so sweet of her to send them my way. They're the watermelon energizing wipes. You can't find them anymore, but I've raved about them because they are just the most like moist best makeup removal wipe because they really get rid of everything but they don't dry out my skin which is what I look for in a wipe because I don't use them all the time because they are so drying but I swear I could use these every day and they like wouldn't dry out my skin so anyways I know they're not available anymore so I don't want to spend too much time on them but that was nice of them to send that to me I also really have been enjoying their blushes they have some liquid blushes that are so so good so let's move on to the next box this one says it's from Urban Decay and I see on it that it says the all nighter vitamin C so I think this is their new setting mist I am a big fan of the original All Nighter. I really have a few different versions of it. Um, the chill one I really like too, but I was really excited to see them coming out with the new ones. This is a fresh take on the All Nighter infused with vitamin C and cactus flower water. It's a powerful formula that helps stop makeup meltdowns. The vibe check is passed, and pro tip, it can even be used on bare skin or before makeup. So that's really cool. So excited to try this one out and see what I think of it. I might give my face a little spritz right now. Give it a nice little like hydration boost. Hmm. I feel like they have the best mister. Has a nice scent to it. Okay. Very, very excited to give this one a go from Urban Decay. I love that they came out with a new one. It's been a while, I think, since they released one of those. Another brand that sent over a restock for me is the brand First Aid Beauty. So this is their anti-dandruff shampoo. I actually just finished a bottle of this. I think I mentioned it over on Instagram, how much I've been enjoying this. If you struggle from dandruff or like dry scalp, I definitely recommend trying this one out. Uh, it's really, really good. I feel like I've noticed a big difference in my dandruff since I started implementing it into my routine. I went through an entire bottle and I swear I have like less flakes. I wouldn't say it took it away like completely, but it definitely minimized the amount that I have um, in my hair. So I think it's great. So it says it's safe for sensitive skin, dermatological tested, um, no artificial fragrance. And what I like about this one is a lot of the like dandruff shampoos that I've tried aren't really like emollients. Like they don't have like that nice like 
lather two of them that I like so much when I wash my hair and this one does so that part I do really like the only con I have with it is a little bit thick of a formula so I did have to like take the um top off instead of like using the little squirt thing because I feel like it's pretty thick but it's a small con because I feel like it's a great product and then they also sent over the um scalp serum that goes with this as well so that's really great I will link that for you guys and then I have Clarins up next and they sent over a skincare product I've actually never received anything from them so this is the new total eye lift and it is a lift replenishing eye concentrate it says all-in-one anti-aging cream that targets wrinkles and crow's feet for visible lifts in 60 seconds flat i might need to do like a video on this because that sounds amazing it says 60 seconds interesting we'll see i'm gonna try this and see if it works really in 60 seconds that sounds pretty amazing uh visible results within seven days firmer tighter and wrinkles diminished in 82 percent of people so I'm going to give that a try on my under eyes and see what I think. I do have some wrinkles, so I'm always looking to help those. And then this is from Ofra and Liore. She came out with her own collaboration, and they sent this my way. Always exciting to see a fellow YouTubers collab with brands, so congrats to Liora. Let's go ahead and show you guys her palette. So it is a eye and face palette. So here's a look at the inside. So you have eyeshadows, blushes, and also a highlight in there, which is really pretty. I'm not sure if this is like a original highlight, but I think it is because the name of it is Heavenly. I don't think I remember um, having that one from Ofra, so I think it's new, so that's exciting. And then she also did a lip product, two lip products with them as well. So she has a lip gloss in Scorpio. That looks really good. And then also a liquid lipstick in Leora. So there is her collection right there. Big congrats to her. I do have a affiliate um, with Ofra. So if you want to shop any of their products, you can use my coupon code, just make up Molly, and it will get you 20% off their website. But so exciting to see someone collab with them. Very, very cool. Up next, I got this little bag here from Lawless, and they came out with a new concealer. I love trying new complexion products. So very excited about that it's new Yenta foundation and now this concealer. So they sent over actually four shades to try out, which I think is great. So that way I can find a perfect shade for me. So this is the Conceal the Deal Full Coverage Concealer. So very new from them. I know they have a foundation in this line. I have not personally um, tried that one, but Lawless is like a newer brand to me. I have tried their Forget the Filler Lip Fillers now. Um, and I think that's all I've really tried from the brand. So I'm kind of new to them. So let me know if you guys have any favorite products of theirs. But this is a full coverage concealer. It has caffeine, antioxidants, complex, and then also flower extract in here it's gonna be $26 available in 20 shades and it's available on Sephora so it says natural pigments deliver high performance payoff while hydrating and toning properties keep the skin looking um, skin looking skin looking like skin throughout the day so it's a clean uh, brand if you haven't known that they are a clean vegan cruelty free makeup brand so very cool I am excited to try this one here from lawless thank you to them for sending that my way so this is a new skincare product up next from pharmacy this is the 10% waterless vitamin C serum so it says it helps target brighten dark spots so let's see what the packaging on this one looks like I like a lot of pharmacies and skincare so I'm excited to try this one it's been a while since I had like a vitamin C in my collection so I might add this one in but here is a look at the packaging right there I've had a lot of really good luck uh, with their products so excited to give that one a try and then I see here from Laura Mercier another complexion products so very exciting this is their tinted moisturizer and I believe this is a new version of it so it says introducing the tinted moisturizer light revealer okay so it's the newest addition to Laura Mercier's iconic franchise with this new skin illuminating formula for an effortless no makeup look so it says it's available at Sephora I have tried the original um, tinted moisturizer from her and I do like it a lot so this is exciting to see a new one so the shade they sent over is the shade cameo so let me know if you guys want to see that in a review. I feel like we have enough to maybe do like a full face of like new products. So if you guys are interested in that, comment down below for sure. Another skincare brand that I love is Glow Recipe and they collaborated with Michaela. So Michaela from TikTok, I'm sure you guys all know her. So she came out with her own little like favorite set with Glow Recipe. So congrats to you girl. Very exciting. So in the inside here you have her beautiful face and then these little clips. I actually love using these for putting up my um, my hair. <laughs> they say what's popping on it. Very cute. If you know Michaela, you know. And I love that they're pink. So very, very nice. 
And then here is a look at the inside. Mine is like not wanting to come out of the packaging, so I'll read it to you. So it's the Waterbound Glow Nice and Mind Dew Drops. So yes, those are like her favorite product. And then we also have the Avocado Ceramide um, Recovery Serum. And then also their Hyaluronic Plumping Cream. So this is like her little gift set there from them. So love um, the Dew Drops. And then I also have tried the cream is really nice too. I wasn't the biggest fan of that um, eye cream. I still like it, but it's not something I regularly use. But I do really like Glow Recipes products. So thanks for sending that and congrats to her. A few more things left here. So this is from GHD, which I'm very excited about. They have hat tools. So I have this little canvas bag. It says, I heart GHD. I always love saving these because I let my family members like shop my makeup. So I'm always letting them shop through my things. So this is, ooh, it's a hair straightener. So it says, we are excited to share with you our number one best seller. This is the Platinum Hair Styler. It's up to 20% off for the Sephora Spring Savings Event. Um, and I actually have a straightener from them, but I have like their mini one. So it works really well for the mini. So this is their Smart Styler. So results with, it says results with stronger hair. I was actually just seeing someone talk about this. I can't remember who it was, but someone was saying that this is like the best straightener for just like straightening and keeping your hair really healthy looking. I forget who it was, it might've been Jacqueline maybe. Um, but I am excited to try this one. Cause like I said, I like the mini one that I have, but sometimes, you know, with like long hair, it takes a little bit but it works really well for a mini. So excited to have like the full size and then the mini one's still good cause it is cordless. So I can take that one with me like traveling really easily. So I'll still keep that one, but thank you at DHD for sending me this new bag. And definitely check them out during the Sephora sale. I feel like that is a really good time to get like hair tools and stuff. I never think about that, but it's really good time to try out like new hair care brands as well as makeup brands. Next from fourth ray, we have the Bloom Service Rose Cleansing Balm. I actually really like using a cleansing balm I don't think I've tried one from um, ColourPop yet or Fourth Ray, so I'm excited to try this one. I don't always love like rose products, but I think in a cleansing balm might be okay because it's not something that's going to be like lingering on your skin and it's just going to be used to like remove my makeup. So I'll try this. I'm going to bring it up to my bathroom and give it a try because I've never tried cleansing balms. I feel like I have those set things that I like love testing out, and for me, it's like cleansing balms sponges and then also like complexion products I just like love testing products like that so I always get excited when I get a new cleanser and then the last box here is from the brand era and they sent over some of their airbrush products so I've actually tried them out before they have an airbrush foundation and like blush the whole nine yards are all like sprayable um, products so they sent over the foundation and then also the bronzer I don't remember trying a bronzer from um, them before so I don't know if this one is new but they're literally just like aerosol cans that you can like spray on your face I know that the best way that they recommend you do it though is actually to spray it like on like a palette or um, like on your hand or something spray it and then apply it like with a sponge or something so I have done that and it is a really nice nice like whipped formula it's very cooling so their products are nice so excited to have those and they also sent over a bunch of their sponges so they must know I love sponges because there is like a ton of different beauty sponges here so we got little mini ones and then also some full-size ones so always excited to try new sponges but after that you guys that is everything for this PR haul and unboxing so like I said now I've got like a giant pile of everything next to me but I hope you guys enjoyed this I'm sorry if to everyone that misses them one day maybe we'll get back to it but for now I'm gonna kind of just sprinkle them in every once in a while but I hope you enjoyed watching again links to everything will be down below and I will see you guys very soon with a brand new video.